the LG B20 user here and today I'll be giving you guys my thoughts and opinions on the Moto E5 smartphones here so Motorola has announced the Moto E5 family of smartphones here the Moto E5 Moto E5 Plus and Moto E5 Play as you guys can see right here on gsmmoney.com and I'm doing the comparison thing here so I can get it all in one video here uh, so hoping you guys will like this some of you guys may not like me doing this but I'm doing it anyway so you know Yes, yeah, so as you guys see right there, these phones look very nice. Um, they look similar. Uh, they look, they look like the Moto E4 from last year, except for the Moto E5 Plus ha has like a glossy back to it, and the uh, Moto E5 and E5 Play have like a plastic back to them. All right. Uh, so let's get in this thing and um, yeah. Uh. So the E5 Plus, as you guys see, has the versions of USA, Brazil. So we'll have to check those out. Well, oops, let's just go. Let's go to all versions here real quick and just do that. Also, uh, they all have um, GSM. Uh, the E5 Plus and the E5 Play support CDMA LTE. Uh, the E5 does not. And I think the E5 is going to uh, cricket. Um, I think. And uh, yeah, I think the E5 is going to cricket. And no, uh, no, wait a minute. I think I think the E5 play is going to cricket, and the E5 plus is going to cricket. The E5 is not going to cricket. I don't know where it's going. If it goes anywhere in the U.S., but um, has all uh, has LT and all of them there, as you guys can see. Uh, speed and all that. And it got announced it's coming out soon. Uh, the weight of the phone is Moto E5 Plus, 6.95 ounces, so it's a hefty motherfucker. Moto E5, 6.14 ounces, and Moto E5 Play, 5.29 ounces there. So hefty phones there, they all take nano SIM cards. The Moto E5 Play is splash resistant, so um, it is not waterproof, guys, so splash resistant is not waterproof. They all have IPS displays, LCD capacitive displays. Uh, they have seven. They they have HD and HD plus displays. The Moto E5 plus and Moto E5 have uh, HD plus displays, and Moto E5 plus have HD display. Uh, the Moto E5 plus has 269 PPI. The Moto E5 has 282 PPI. And Moto E5 Play 282 PPI, alright. Uh, 5.99 inches on the uh, E5 Plus, and 5.7 inches on Moto E5, and 5.2 inches on Moto E5 Play, alright. They have mul they all have multi touch corning gorilla glass, except for the Moto E5. It's plastic. The Moto E5 Play is plastic. They all run Android Oreo. And, um, they have a uh, stock Android experience there. A couple of Motorola uh, customization stone in there, like the Moto display and the actions and whatnot. Uh, they feature Android Oreo and all of them, like I said. They all have uh, quad core configurations 1.4 GHz quad core on all of them, uh, Snapdragon 425 on all of them, and Snapdragon 427. That's probably the US version, the Snapdragon 427. They have Adrenaline 308 graphics on all of them. Micro SD cards up to 256 gigabytes. Uh, the Moto E5 Plus have 32 gigabytes of storage and 3 gigabytes of RAM, or 16 gigabytes of storage and 2 gigabytes of RAM. The Moto E5 and E5 Play have 2 gigabytes of RAM and 16 gigabytes of storage. All right, guys. So keep that in mind. Uh, they all have single rear cameras. E5 Plus 12 megapixels. Moto E5, 13 megapixels, Moto E5 Play, 8 megapixels, they all have LED flashes, both record 1080p videos at 30 frames, uh, they all have 5 megapixel frame facing cameras with LED flash, the, uh, the US version of the Moto E5 Plus has 8 megapixel frame facing camera, they all have vibrations and all that. Headphone jack, loudspeaker, noise cancellation microphone on all. Wi Fi 8211 BG on all of them. Hotspot Bluetooth 4.2 on all of them. Low energy Bluetooth, GPS. 
infrared port, no FM, yes. Uh, motor E5 Plus and motor E5 supports Type C, and E5 Play supports micro USB 2.0. So keep that in mind, alright? Um, I wish they were all Type C's, but I don't know why Motorola decided to put uh, 2.0 in the E5 Play. That's the oh, that's the least expensive one here. That's the one that has a plastic back to it. They all have fingerprint sensors on the back. Uh, the M M Motorola logo is your fingerprint sensor, so that, that's a nice touch. Um, has email, browser, HTML5 browser. Uh, the Motor E5 Plus has a 5,000 milliamp battery. The Motor E5 has 4,000 milliamp, and the Motor E5 Play has 2,800 milliamp battery. Uh, the batteries on the Moto E5 Plus and Moto E5 are not removable, but however, the battery on the Moto E5 Play is removable, so you can put an additional battery in there if you would like. Um, the colors on the, on these phones, uh, the Moto E5 Plus, black, flash gray, mineral blue, fine gold, Moto E5 gold and platinum, Moto E5 Play, black, dark lake, I think it's like a Black Dark Lake and Flash Gray. I don't know what Dark Lake is. I don't know what the fuck that is. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so, uh, that's the most expensive one. This is the most expensive one. This is the second expensive and This is the least expensive. Uh, this one's going to Cricket and Verizon. This one is. Uh, it's going to Cricket as the Moto E5 Cruise. And uh, Craig is also getting the E5 Plus as a Moto E5 Spirit or something like that. It's some weird ass thing, but yeah, so that's all versions. Let's check, just check out what they get in Brazil. Uh, this is the Brazil, the, the Brazil version. Uh, they get sent back in 425 on all of them, I guess. I don't know what the difference is. I don't freaking know. I don't know. I don't. I, I don't know what the difference are. Be honest, since I can't tell. So if it has like a, uh, it says it right there. So let's see what the U.S. gets. So, uh, the U.S. is different here. Snapdragon four twenty five. So Cricket's getting a good deal on this Moto E5 Plus here, man. The specs are pretty damn good. Um, uh, let's check out some pictures on the phone, you know. Uh, the phone looks very nice. They look looks like the Moto E4 from last year, but they uh, they all have an 18 by 9 x back ratio, I think. I think they do. I I, I think they got an 18 by 9 x back ratio on all of them. Oh, um, nope, 16 by 9 on Moto E5 Play, and 18 by 9 x-ray ratios on uh, E5 Plus and E5. E5 Play is the lower end version, so you're getting watered down specs on that. So do keep that in mind. So let's check out the Moto E5 Plus up close. Um, that's what it looks like front and back. Um, I'm a big fan of the clock. It has your Motorola, your Motorola logo. Stock end with your Moto app. I'm not sure what's in there. Um, bank print sensor, uh, dual cameras. Looks like it's dual cameras, but I don't. Mm. I'm a big fan of the clock. Uh, nice, nice, nice glossy back to it. Um, you know, that's what it looks like front and side there. Headphone jack from the uh, top, charging point at the bottom. Fire button on the right, fire button on the right. Oh, uh, these phones look really nice, man. The, the Moto E5 Plus. Get that fucking, get that phone, you guys are saying, get the E5 Plus, get that phone. That phone is a boss in terms of specs. The E5, the Moto E5, the, the, I guess the regular E5, whatever. There it is. Looks like the Moto uh, 
E5 plus, but it, has, it looks like it has like a plastic back to it, so not too bad. It's a single camera on this one, flash, fingerprint sensor, front facing camera, flash, moto app. Um, it has duo on there, so that's pretty good if you guys use that. Um, you guys can see it has the moto, uh, the moto E4 right there. They look, they look like the moto E4 from last year and shit like that, in my opinion. Uh, there it is on the side. Headphone jack on top, charging port on bottom, right, volume buttons on right, power, volume buttons on right, and power buttons on right. Uh, and these are nice looking phones. They're really nice phones. Uh, this is this is a plastic back. Uh, this one's splash resistant. The E5 play is not. Um. This one, this is the this this is the phones in all plastic here. Um, and you guys see the specs right on there. Um. Oh, there it is, front and back. Oh, you got your camera there, flash, fingerprint sensor. At least this one has a fingerprint sensor. At least that's a win. Uh, front facing camera flash, 16 by 9 x back ratio. Uh, this one's going to Verizon and Cricket, as far as I know. It's probably, it probably, it probably will go to Boost as well, probably. But as far as I know, it's going to Verizon and uh, Cricket. As the Moto E5 cruise for Cricket. And the Moto E5 play for Verizon. Um, I like the clock. I'm a big fan of the clock there. Fingerprint sensor. Uh, single wear camera. There. Um, that's uh, that's a single rear camera right there. Single rear. That one looks like it's dual rear. Let me see. Hang on. Camera, camera, camera. Uh, Twelve megapixels. Base detection. Um, I don't know. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The back on the uh, Moto E5 Plus, guys, it's not dual cameras, it's uh, laser autofocus. And I'll show you guys that here again. That I just like it had like two fucking cutouts. Wait a minute, what? No, your camera's right here. Your laser autofocus is right here. Your uh, camera flash is right here, alright? So your laser autofocus is up here, your camera flash is right there. It has a big ass six damn five point nine nine inches wow. That's a nice fucking phone man. Cricket's Cricket gets getting a good deal on this phone, uh they're get they um Yeah and, and yeah these friends are going to prepaid. Two of these friends are going to prepaid as far as I know. Uh the Moto E5 Play and Moto E5 Plus are going to prepaid. Uh, I think Verizon will get the Moto E5 Plus as well. Um, Cricket's getting both of these phones, so is Verizon. Um, so if you guys are getting these phones on Cricket, get the Moto E5 Plus. It's a fucking boss. That phone just looks so fucking nice. I bet you it looks nice in person, man. That phone just looks so fucking nice. It looks like the Moto E4 from last year. But it has a glossy back to it on the Moto E5 Plus. And that's the phone I suggest you guys go with. If you guys are thinking about getting one of these phones, get the Moto E5 Plus. But if you guys want to get like a backup phone or whatever, get the Moto E5 Play. It's not a bad little phone. It's a plastic body phone. The battery is removable on the Moto E5 Play. Though, the uh, battery is not removable on Moto E5 Plus or E5. So keep that in mind. So, um... Yeah, what do you guys think about this phones? Are you guys getting these phones? Um, I don't know when this phones will be going to Cricket and Verizon. As far as I know, there's only two preview carriers that have said that they're getting these phones. Other preview carriers might announce them later on. So, um, yeah, what do you guys think about this phones? Are you guys going to get one of these phones? Uh, I suggest you guys get the Moto E5 Plus. It's a boss. It's a nice looking phone. Uh, the specs on there are pretty damn good. Not bad for what it is. It's a budget phone. It's a mid-range phone. So it is what it is, guys. So, um, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. So if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It really helps me out a lot. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.